I'm Philip Elton Collins, one of the co-founders of the Angel News Network. There are about six, seven, eight, nine billion of us on the planet now. We're all involved in a process of ascension, the planet moving into light, and we joining that process. Through the process of ascension, I was led to create a book called Sacred Poetry and Mystical Messages. And I'm going to be reading some of these points and bringing them to you through a series of poetry readings. I hope you enjoy it. Today, I'm going to read a poem called The I Am Presence. What is this thing, this force called the I Am? What exactly is present in its name? A force, a presence that has no shame nor blame? We hear the Christ and the name Saint Germain associated with this, the same. Does anyone truly understand this name? that has neither shame nor blame? Let us now attempt to explain. The I Am seems ancient in its claim to have created all in this domain. By the mere spoken word, the power of creation is released and elevation. But since we are part of creation, this I Am force is part of self-relation. The promise of this power, we are told, is ours forevermore. Whatever follows the words I am, life forces give mirth to the birth. I am first vibrates in the brain, followed by flesh it becomes the same. I am that I am is also my name, and I can know I am connected to all with no shame. It is imperishable, eternal, individual identity of every human being rather than being, rather than doing, just being. Perhaps I am is just what humanity needs to know it is already divine perfection indeed.